Hello everyone, congratulations our uh, YouTube channel has reached uh, subscribers uh, uh, till 3333, a total of subscribers and this is all uh, due to uh, appreciation from your side and uh, I am thankful for that and uh, I am hopeful also that I will be uh, producing more uh, useful videos or informative uh, that can help for the uh, freshers. Uh, to uh, start their career or already experienced guys who need to uh, transform to uh, D35 technical or functional areas and other products which are basically financial financial nature. So in this video uh, I will be covering uh, one more thing which is basically from Microsoft and uh, that is a cloud skill challenge. Normally this event Microsoft uh, held uh, hold up I mean uh, year to year uh, certain month of a year uh, and region wise. So uh, in that uh, you also participate in various uh, you know training uh, tra training opportunities like presentations and uh, uh, so you uh, you learn about Microsoft products. So in, in the same event also there is uh, also challenges given to the uh, to the uh, candidates who wants to basically uh, increase their knowledge through Microsoft material or training material or documents. So uh, you need to complete a challenge and you can earn a free Microsoft certification exam. So this time also uh, there are seven challenges available uh, in this Ignite challenge and the uh, uh, exam will basically uh, offer will be delivered till 18th of November and today is 30, 30th September and uh, uh, once you complete a challenge and then uh, you need to basically take the exam before uh, February 15, 2023 and uh, you must complete exam before this date as per the instructions and there are certain official rules we will uh, we'll just see in a moment. But first of all, uh, a brief, uh, you know, uh, introduction about each of the challenge is also uh, shown on the website. I will share the link. And uh, here you can see Microsoft Ignite Intelligent Cloud Challenge is available. And this is normally for Azure infrastructure architect or uh, the persons who are involved in networking or inf infrastructure like things, virtualization, identity, security and uh, various other uh, factors like disaster recovery so you can attempt that challenge and uh, there is another challenge of uh, microsoft Ignite cloud app maker challenge that is for power platform and uh, that is also you know i would recommend for my viewers to at least uh, attempt this one and uh, then on a free microsoft exam uh, voucher that will not enable you for the certification but also uh, will make you eligible if you are a Microsoft trainer, if you want to become Microsoft trainer and you are already uh, you know giving a, a training um, uh, in on different forums. So you can also be eligible for MCT and uh, lastly as far as I know MCT fees was also waived off by Microsoft. You need to double check that one as well and uh, uh, check the I will show the prerequisite to become a Microsoft certified trainer. And then the next challenge is Ignite AI automation challenge that is for artificial intelligent, uh, intelligent uh, uh, artificial intelligence and that is basically for machine learning models and to explore data analysis like big data you need to analyze the trends and various things. So making use of AI concept, artificial intelligence concept and similarly modern work challenge and that involves Microsoft Teams in order to communicate how to arrange live events or uh, calling, video conferencing, meeting. This is for uh, anyone who is basically using uh, Microsoft uh, platform and uh, Microsoft platform. Uh, for communication, official communication. Similarly, there is a Microsoft Ignite Protect Everything Challenge and that is for security guys who want to protect for cyber threats, incident management, custom query language, KQL. This is for security uh, people in the networking team normally 
uh, that that is interesting uh, uh, exam as well. Similarly, there are uh, there is a Microsoft Ignite field service automation challenge and that is for Dynamics 365 field service mobile app and connected field service uh, internet of things solution uh, field service user roles service task inspections work orders. So, that is also one of the interesting challenge. Then lastly, Microsoft Ignite Cloud Developer Challenge is available uh, for the people who want to do, uh, you know, uh, DevOps, you know, DevOps is a project management tool and that allows versioning, uh, version control uh, for the source code as well. Uh, so, this challenge will uh, allow you to learn various concepts about this. So, you need to, uh, first of all, if you don't have any uh, live ID, that is uh, on Microsoft platform like hotmail.com or outlook.com. You need to create a live ID or email address the, on the Microsoft platform and then you need to register yourself. And uh, then I need to just show you the rules, the official rules. So, these are terms and conditions. And uh, here, uh, you know, the challenge starts on October 12th. 2022 at 4 p.m. UTC and uh, that ends on November 9th. So, it means it is almost a month. Uh, it is almost a month to complete uh, any of seven challenges and uh, also you need to rec uh, you need to provide an email for registration of that challenge and uh, also you need to uh, tick mark for notifications so that you you will be receiving the free exam voucher. So, so, uh, anyone, uh, a person who has one email ID can take up all the seven challenges also, uh, not only seven actually, yeah, it is seven, but here I think eight exams are shown and uh, so uh, any uh, one ID can subscribe to all the uh, challenges, but they will receive only one exam voucher. So, one person will receive one exam voucher. Uh, so, also uh, there are certain other conditions you need to go through uh, from this, these uh, terms and uh, these are the exams which will be, uh, you know, uh, you will be taking part in into those exams and uh, uh, instructions say that exam offer is ex exam specific and it is not allowed to take any other exam based upon that voucher against that ID. So, means if you are taking for example, uh, this cloud app maker challenge so cloud app maker challenge will basically allow you uh, which one here uh, that is this uh, pl100 microsoft power platform app maker similarly if you are taking you know the cloud developer challenge so cloud developer will allow you this one uh, az400 designing and implementing microsoft devops solutions so, uh, this one is also interesting one and also the designing Microsoft Azure infrastructure solution. This will be uh, based upon first one. This will allow uh, this exam. In this way, each of the challenge will allow you to get a voucher against one of these exams. And uh, similarly, the redemption time as all, uh, I told you. Uh, start from uh, 18th of November till 15th of Feb. You need to take the exam uh, between these two dates, and uh, and the expiration uh, will be uh, you know uh, cannot be extended. And there are certain other condition. If you have any issues or uh, you need any guidance, you can write to this email address. So they will respond to uh, to you within three business days. And uh, then I will also show you one of the cloud app maker challenge. Once you click uh, this uh, link, so you will uh, be reaching at this page, which will show you a timer or timeline uh, like 12 days are left and how many hours, minutes and seconds are left uh, before the challenge basically starts. And uh, if you are registered, uh, then it will show you you are a register come back on October 12th. And if you are not registered, you will get here a link in order to register your uh, email address and then automatically you will receive a notification when the challenge starts or you can bookmark this page 
through uh, any uh, you know the bookmark feature of your browser so then uh, it is showing a flow chart like uh, you need to uh, develop a skills learn and compete and then there are f uh, frequently asked questions which you can also go through and uh, similarly each of the challenge will uh, lend uh, you to certain page okay now uh, before that i will show you here this is a microsoft power platform app maker exam so this one is uh, for, uh, the second challenge here uh, cloud app maker challenge once you complete it so you will be attempting you will get a voucher free voucher and you will be basically uh, attempting this exam and even before attempt attempting attempting this exam you can directly go to the collection of uh, or the material available for this exam which is showing online free of, uh, uh, free material and uh, uh, not only when challenges start you can start it but uh, from now on you can also read the material available and uh, it will show you that uh, progress whatever you are making uh, into that uh, specific topics and uh, each topic is containing modules number of modules so you can easily uh, go through these and uh, let me tell you i uh, as far as this exam is concerned it does not require you to have a, a programming skill so this is you know easy wizard like uh, uh, wizard like process and uh, it does not require you to have a programming skill so i think this one is easy and i would recommend for functional consultants as well to attempt uh, this exam and once you uh, you pass the exam and uh, uh, you know normally the fee is for example united states is dollar 165 usd and for each country uh, there is a different fees which will be waived off once you complete the challenge so for pakistan it is us dollar 80 and if you go for uh, india so 4800 indian rupees similarly if you go to germany so in euros 165 euros and for different countries uh, they are showing different fee saudi it is showing a dollar 165 us usd so so they are giving you a free voucher uh, to attempt this exam uh, so then i will uh, show you uh, how to become microsoft certified trainer if you are involved in training activities uh, so this one is the page uh, where you can get all the information about uh, becoming a microsoft certified trainer and microsoft certified trainer uh, bec becoming a mct will basically give you so many benefits from microsoft uh, so it will give you uh, for example software keys for evolution purposes it will give you uh, for example 100 dollars azure credit so that you can test various functionalities available on cloud uh, on azure cloud and you can test it uh, and learn it and learn it before you give training to your students and uh, there are other benefits which are also listed here you can check it and uh, the microsoft M mct program entry requirements are like you must have been uh, given uh, given uh, the trainings uh, on these various uh, you know platforms and uh, apart from this mct pro application process is also defined here you can also ask you know by contact contacting on this email and uh, also the uh, eligible exams which are basically make you eligible for mct are available in this whole uh, big list and you can see here microsoft power platform app maker associate is also available which is part of ignite challenge so you just give this one exam and pass it and you will become eligible for mct if you are already have enough evidence to provide the training and similarly there is a dynamics 365 field service functional consultant as associate this one is also available and uh, you can also check other exams as well uh, which might be available here uh, which will allow you to become uh, mct like this azure developer associate is also available this one if i can show you here at the bottom cloud developer challenge is available and uh, if you see here i think this one this one was this microsoft devops solution 
yes this one was for devops solution az 400 so uh, these exams are available uh, in mct uh, and uh, prerequisites and once you pass it you can become uh, you can apply for mct as well which uh, i think so far it is free but you need to double check it and uh, once you become mct you can avail various uh, benefits out of that and uh, this one is also a page microsoft power platform app maker associate and from this page as i have already shown to you and this one is for field service functional consultants and uh, here also there is online free documentation or training available you can even start from now if you are interested or you can wait till the challenge starts even after challenge is start uh, microsoft will pick up um, you know certain modules from each of these topics and include as a challenge and you need to just go through it practice it and then uh, just complete the challenge it should be 100 percent completed on the challenge page which is available once you uh, click it for example if i click this one so it is showing me now timer but as soon as, as it, it starts so it will be showing you here outline of uh, the documentation or training which you need to go through and uh, it will show you the completeness and whoever has uh, have been completing the challenge will be shown here the list how many people have completed and their names will be appearing for you the profile 100% uh, completeness will basically make you eligible on the date which is which was uh, earlier on i showed you here uh, various dates it, it starts on uh, 12th and uh, october and november uh, november 9 it will end and then you will receive the voucher and through which you need to give the exam. So the uh, redemption starts from 18th of November. Yeah. So after that you need to uh, basically attempt the exam. So I am hopeful this will basically help for the uh, for the refreshers, for the uh, subscribers of my channel who want to also certify themselves and learn uh, new uh, things and they want to certify themselves in uh, Microsoft uh, uh, technologies or skills and uh, they want to enrich their CVs and then apply uh, to various jobs which uh, basically interest them and uh, these are I mean the eco, eco uh, plat uh, power platform and these are ecosystem around D3S5 and uh, this will basically uh, help you even you are uh, D3S5 consultant you will need to learn uh, definitely power platform and uh, you know security aspects so i don't uh, find that uh, one uh, i mean if you attempt any of these uh, it will not be useless it will help you somehow so you need to uh, become expert in the uh, whole ecosystem so uh, definitely this will uh, enrich and add value to your cv I am hopeful this is quite informative for the uh, subscribers of my channel and uh, uh, definitely let me know if you have any queries and uh, let me know if once you have uh, you know subscribed to the challenge and uh, and then uh, attempted uh, completed the challenge and then uh, uh, got the voucher and then attempted the exam uh, just let me know throughout till you pass an exam and also if someone they also uh, extend it to till the MCT exam as well and once you also attempted the M, uh, not attempted MCT is not an exam but if you have become eligible and you have applied for MCT and become MCT just mention in your comment uh, under this video so that at least I am happy that uh, one of the subscribers uh, have completed the whole uh, you know uh, track and they have uh, become MCT this will be uh, you know I will be very happy for uh, for you thank you very much guys I think this uh, is informative for the uh, new uh, new guys who want to become you know uh, uh, consultants in future and uh, uh, let me know about if you have any queries thank you very much guys take care bye bye